Hello, everyone, and welcome to the third SOC conference on application of free software and open hardware, and to the first virtual SOC event. This conference is organized by the School of Electrical Engineering, University of Belgrade, and I would kindly ask our Dean, Professor Milo Tomasevic, to open SOC conference officially. Please, Professor. Ladies and gentlemen, dear participants, dear guests, although I don't, I can see you, uh, I have a great pleasure to welcome and greet all of you on behalf of School of Electrical Engineering, the main organizer of this event on the occasion of the opening of the PSSOH conference. So as Nadisa said, it is now for the third time that we are meeting in late October to exchange the ideas and uh, share the experiences on application of uh, free software and uh, open hardware and some related issues. First two conferences went in physical, traditional way, last one in this very room. And uh, this year, as a consequence of well-known circumstances, uh, we go online and virtual. Although this uh, goes online, uh, offers some advantages and conveniences. Uh, you uh, can attend the conference without showing up and spend some money and so on. I think that uh, still, uh, regrettably, the audience will miss networking, meeting new people, uh, coffee break chats, with the atmosphere, which are a significant asset of a physically held conference. But uh, now, this year, we will have an international renowned keynote speaker in the plenary session. Uh, we have some uh, young people in the program and so on. A mm, couple of words about the spirit of this event and the conference. You can, if you take a look at the program, you can find a number of presentations spanning a wide spectrum of competencies and from software and hardware engineering to humanities. Uh, I think that uh, this a multi professional profile of this conference's big value and special flavor of the conference as it is uh, evidently successful in attracting and bringing together people uh, researching and working in uh, diverse areas. Uh, at least now uh, the tradition is preserved uh, and the conference still goes on. Personally, I like very much the spirit of this conference and uh, also I'm keen on uh, principles of this free software and open hardware community. Most probably because of some nostalgic reasons, because uh, these principles advocates for values uh, quite similar to those uh, I raised and educated on. So last year, as I remember, I used a metaphor comparing the ideas of this and principles of this community with an idea of someone who would say uh, historically outdated ideology, uh, which tells uh, it doesn't matter how much uh, one contribute if he contribute as much as uh, uh, he can. And also, it doesn't matter how much someone takes if he takes only as little as he needs. Uh, again, I will be free uh, to share with you a, a very free religious-based analogy uh, and you are free to uh, regard it appropriate or not. So I used 
the word three, three times <laughs> in the last sentence. Uh, I think that principles of this uh, community are quite conformant uh, uh, with a quotation uh, from uh, New Testament. Uh, Matthew's Gospel and it reads, uh, ask and it shall be given to you, uh, seek and you shall find, knock and it will be opened upon you. So I think that this community share this principle and this principle should be inherent to the field of science uh, generally, but I'm not sure that it always holds. Not to mention uh, the world that surrounds us, which can be quite greedy and ungiving but I think that this uh, principle is not an utopia and I, I'm still a believer. Uh, as a matter of fact, uh, you are aware of ongoing uh, corona crisis and uh, quite uh, awkward and even dangerous situation that surround us. Uh, and I still believe that it should teach us and cause for values like tolerance, solidarity, sharing, uh, unselfishness, uh, giving, uh, openness, and uh, probably unity in the first place. Uh, simply this, uh, yeah, although practically preventive measures uh, call for physical isolation. I think that the unity is more important than that. And if diligent organizers of this event consider uh, adopting some permanent motto of this conference, I will be free again to suggest uh, a uh, old Latin proverb, uh, gen suna sumus, we are one people. Okay, uh, I think I'm running out of my time uh, of all 35 minutes, uh, so I, it's time to conclude this opening note. Uh, last year, uh, the conference was, was definitely better uh, than the first one, and uh, in spite of the circumstances, I really hope that uh, this year conference uh, would be better uh, than the previous one, and that it will keep on improving and enhancing in the years to come. Uh, I'm also obliged to uh, and uh, I wish to acknowledge the effort of some people and uh, to uh, express our gratitude to all those who uh, made this unprofit pos uh, event possible uh, by providing the support in any way. So let me finish by uh, wishing you all the best, uh, all, most of the success in this conference. Uh, uh, enjoy this one day uh, in event and uh, also uh, by maybe more important, uh, stay sound in body and mind in this uh, dangerous time. Thank you.